Would you like to double the life of your e-bike battery? Of course, right? I wanted to talk to you about uh, something that's quite alarming. You might find that the same sorts of lithium batteries get an eight year warranty in an electric car, but only a one year warranty on an electric bike. So why is this? And can we come towards the middle with our e-bike batteries? Well, the answer is yes. So I wanna start just by explaining. Firstly, the difference between a cell so this is a little battery cell. Many of these cells are put together in order to make a battery pack. So for an electric bike, this is an e-bike pack. It's made up of, in this case, about 60 of these cells or slightly larger ones. And the same sort of pack is put together with the same sorts of cells for an electric car. However, of course, there's a lot more of these cells in an electric car because there's a lot more space to put them. So this brings us to the point where if you don't need to be so dense with space in a car, you don't have to push as much energy into each cell, therefore not stressing it as much. When the pack is small, but the range desired is large, the electricity forced into this pack is delivered to a higher voltage. So most cells in these packs are designed to charge up to 4.2 volts per cell. 10 years ago, we started selling e-bike batteries. They were lithium ferrophosphate back in the day, which was very heavy, but also very long lasting. So they were good quality cells. Then lithium manganese oxide came in and other lithium oxide and manganese cobalt based batteries came in. And we saw their lifespan was dropping quite considerably compared to the ferrophosphate packs earlier. About five or six years ago, we were finding a lot of packs coming back and a, a shorter lifespan than what we wanted. So we started doing some research at Rev Bikes. What we discovered was that some very small changes in the way you discharge and the way you charge the packs makes a huge difference overall to the lifespan of the pack. So as you can see by the graph that's now on your screen, if you charge a battery cell to 4.2 volts versus 4.1, you can see that the lifespan of 4.1 is actually twice that of being charged to 4.2. That's a significant improvement for only a 10% loss in capacity. So by charging the cell to 4.1 volts instead of 4.2, we do reduce the range to about 90% of what we would be getting otherwise. But in terms of doubling the number of charge cycles, we think it's a fair enough trade-off. So typically people may get between three and 500 charge cycles per pack. That means from empty to full with your e-bike battery, about 500 times, and then what happens then? You have to find an identical battery to bring your e-bike back to life. You may need to get it repacked if you can't find the same pack somewhere else. This can be expensive, starting at about $500 for average e-bike batteries, and some of them are not easily replaceable. We developed our own technology, which is specific BMSs, which can charge manage the charging cycle so it doesn't go above 4.1 volts. Also, a specific charger that comes as a Lovo, it's a 4.1 volts per cell. So these are available in 36 or 48 volt versions. And as a result, we're able to offer a two to three year warranty on our batteries. When you're using a Revbikes Lovo battery, you will be actually saving yourself significant cost, significant inconvenience by having a battery that lasts five, six years or more. And you will also be doing the planet a favor by not creating as much chemical landfill waste. This is something that if you don't have access to Revbikes technology and you have to go with the common industry standards, which would prefer you to have to buy another battery sooner from them, what a shame. You can self-manage this process in a way. So reduce the charging voltage. So take the battery off before it's fully charged. 
That will allow your battery to have a longer life, but you must fully charge it one time in five so all these cell groups balance out and you retain a good long um, range for your pack. So if you'd like any more information about the Lovo technology, please visit revbikes.com and you'll find products with the Lovo technology available for sale as well as a whole lot more information. I've been Rev Becker, thanks for watching. Nice.